G'day ice cream lovers, my name's T. Christensen here again at the Sea Egypt Show, Rimini, Italy. Hey, um, one star, well look, in the United States the percentage of gelato stores is relatively minimal. If you're on the East Coast or the West Coast, there's still a lot of gelato, but in the Midwest we struggle a little bit, I think, to really appreciate some of this Italian product. Anyway, um, one of the ways in which more traditional gelato uh, retailers and gelaterias uh, go through the process of displaying their product is in a Pozzetti case. Now many people are uh, probably aware with a forced air cabinet that holds the five litre pans or the Napoli's. Uh, but behind me here we have what I think is relatively new at this, uh, the technology is not new but these Pozzetti cases that are almost like a hybrid where it's actually showing the product um, as well as trying to keep it uh, as fresh as you can. And on a Pozzetti case you go to a lot of um, gelaterias where the product even isn't on display. You've just got a simply a decorated lid and the, the um, actual product is in a stainless bin in within the counter that's surrounded by either glycol or forced air. Uh, but here you've got a hybrid case where you don't necessarily have the glycol running around, but you do have um, the actual pot sitting in a case which is both preserving its freshness uh, but also showing some some pretty impressive uh, visuals of the product. Now the downside obviously is that when the level of that bowl goes down you really got to maintain it and make sure it looks well. When you've got a lot of glass here and a lot of perspex, there's a lot of visuality, good and bad. But um, I think that that's something that's relatively new. This is the ESA stand. Um, I'll put a link down here. But um, yeah, really good looking uh, case. Make sure you keep it clean. But I think for me, that's one of the uh, new things that we've seen here at the show this year. Keep on scooping, folks. See you in the next video.